No, I was editing this one really quick and I thought that I would show it to you since I'm sitting here. Um, these, this is the Brilliance Collection. It came as a bonus with the Sun Kiss Collection. Um, so I think that I'm just going to hit that one. And you can see if that's all you use, that's a pretty good edit right there. Um, and you saw the before is what I started with. So I will open this up in Photoshop really quick and show you a little edit. There you go. We really don't even have to do anything to the background on this. If you wanted to, you can. Um, you can do deep spring background. And I'm just going to brush it on here and probably reduce the opacity. But like I've said in previous videos, I like to brush it on at a high opacity so I can kind of see where it is. And then reduce my opacity and brush off anything that I don't want to brush on. So there we go. Make sure those outers are done. What I'll probably do is hit X and that takes my brush back to a black brush. And then I'm going to put my brush opacity at maybe 40% and then brush back off of them. And my computer always runs really slow when I'm trying to record. So, here we go. So there that is, that's a very dynamic uh, background there. I like that a lot. And let me just make sure, because I can't tell if my brush did what it was supposed to. And I have my flow a little bit lower as well, so it kind of helps a little bit. So, and I, I was taking it off at 40% because I kind of want to leave it on places. And then I usually just, like I said, when I'm editing just normal portraits, I tend to just flatten after each action because I kind of know what I'm going to do, um, especially after I do the first picture. Um, I know pretty much what I'm going to do. So anyways, I ran Spring Arise and Shine and Summer Spotlight. I'm going to double click on that and kind of take that over a little bit and reduce the opacity a bit. And I think that's it. Um, if you wanted to make this mat, there's a couple of different directions you could go. The apple pie is beautiful. Um, and you can even reduce the opacity a little bit. And my kids are home from school. Can you hear them? Yes. <laughs> Um, so there's, I always do the sharpen noise to kind of finish it off. So I'll do that really quick and then we can play around with some of the mats here. Merge layers. Okay. So here would just be my basic edit, which I thoroughly enjoy. And there's a matte finish if you wanted to do something like that. We could turn that if you, oops, don't want to mess that up. Uh, you could just do the vignette if you didn't want to do the whole image. But they're on the side, so I probably wouldn't do that with this. Um, I think Tangerine would also be beautiful on this. That's another one of my favorite ones. Um, Deep Matte, I think, would be beautiful. Gorgeous. Peaches and Cream is also a really pretty one. Just bring that down a little bit. Um, let's see. Sweet Tea is always a beautiful one, too. So, anyways, I kind of just wanted to show you guys those. If you want to do a brighter edit right there after you got done. And there's blush. That one's also really pretty. But as you can see, these are really beautiful little washes. Let me see. Um, if the grass is too green for you, you could always do the lemon lime uh, grass be gone or green be gone. Um, if you wanted to maybe make her dress a little bit more pink, which I wouldn't, but I just wanted to show you the action. <laughs> um, you're just going to brush it on like this. And you can either, I just brushed that on at 40%, but you can see we just, it's kind of pretty like that. I really like it. Anyway, so I thought I would show you guys just a little quick edit again um, while I was doing this for my clients. And as I said before, these are all um, in the store. This is the other one that I did today if you wanted to see it right here. Uh, the sun kiss actions are at kansaspits.bigcartel.com. And they are the first ones in the very beginning. And like I said, that comes with the bonus Lightroom presets. Um, if you wanted to see the history right here, I think. 
Um, that's what we started with. And then that's what we ended with. Well, no, that's not what we ended with. We ended with this. But I'll show you the before and after on this too. Boom, boom. Okay, perfect. Thanks, guys.